the NFL was out of the Colin Kaepernick business. You had yeah. the collusion. Yep. Like, they had moved past this. It's week 11 of the season. I, and then all of a sudden, you know, NFL writers get a heads up. We got a big announcement on Tuesday. And then you tell Kaepernick. And then, hey, teams, get together. Why not do this in March? Why Why now? It's it, 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 Honestly, the, the, we don't have an answer. My theory, and it's just a theory, is that this is the NFL's response to Colin Kaepernick's team releasing its statement to correct the quote-unquote false narratives, end of quote, that existed about Colin Kaepernick, which was a two-page statement released October 10th that detailed what it believed are factual things about Colin Kaepernick in his case, and they wanted it to be spelled out this way, that he has not had a visit. He has not been called. He has not had a workout. He's been training five days a week for three years and still not gotten anything. His numbers are better than most of the quarterbacks that are in the league. He can adapt to any system. He's willing to go to any system. It was a whole two pages of sheets of information. And I, I think the NFL didn't like to lose control of the Colin Kaepernick narrative. And, and they did open it up. And it surprises me, too, because – the league is having a great season. It's been nice. It's been peaceful. It's been enjoyable. We got Lamar Jackson and Deshaun Watson playing this week. We got a game in Mexico City. There's a lot of great storylines. And now we're back to this. I know. Now we're back to this. The whole can of worms has been open. And I said to somebody the other night, I said, I, I don't get it. Like, don't you want to move past this? And someone said to me, I would, they think there are people – within the league, I, I don't know, that like this, that want this, which I can't believe, but that was what one person said to me the other night. And so here we are again. So, and, you know, because it, it, it's such a polarizing topic. You know, I've gotten texts and calls from people, boy, this guy has gotten you know, screwed over and he deserves another change. And I've gotten other texts like, how could they even consider this guy? Know. You know, like, one guy texted me last night, your, your wife lost her husband on 9-11. How could you even want this guy back in the NFL? Like, I, it's, it's great, but that's the kind of emotion that he arouses in people. And the NFL, by itself, by itself, put the issue back on the front burner. They made that decision because Colin Kaepernick didn't know anything about this proposed workout that came about Tuesday. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune in to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV, stream for free on BR Live, or download the Dan Patrick Show app.